Focus on love. Sweet job. Hi guys. So this is a what's in my bag video. If you love these types of videos like I do, then keep watching. This is a Valentino handbag. It's in a caramel crocodile reptile print. It is all leather. It has gold hardware. It's a zip top closure. It has a long adjustable strap here where um, it will accommodate, you know, all different types. So I'm five foot six inches for reference. So it drops on me at the hips. So I could wear this comfortably as a crossbody or over the shoulder today. I wear it over the shoulder. Um, I will say that right now the strap is really firm. It's almost like hard, but this is the type of leather that after you keep wearing it, it will get softer and softer. You will have to watch out though. Make sure like creams and oils don't get on here because it will get rubbery. It'll start having a film. But right now it's super structured. And like I said, the more wear, it'll get softer and softer. Um, on the front, it has the Valentino rock studs um, on the sides of the plate. And it has Valentino written out across the plate. And all of this is in gold. I love when the Valentino is written out versus the V. I don't like the embossed V and I don't like the letter V. Whether it's small or large, I just don't like it. I think it cheapens the handbag. And I don't like that everybody can just automatically know what kind of handbag I have on. I like it more understated. Okay, there is an interior zip pocket in here. I should have asked what color is in here. If you want to comment down below and tell me what color it looks like to you all. And then I'll definitely let you guys know what color is in here. But there is an interior zip pocket here. And then um, it did come with a dust bag. A dust cover. And um, there's a plate. A large plate in the inside right there. And hopefully you guys can see it. That has... Valentino written across there as well. Um, this handbag retails for $900 before tax. So it's like right under a thousand after tax. Um, and so let's see what's in my zip pocket here. I actually have some Neosporin. I keep creamy Neosporin with me all the time. I have some lip products here. Um, I have some eye drops by Zine. I also have um, some more lip products. This is that Love Your Lips lip balm that I picked up from Target in um, Coral Gables, Florida. And I have I have a silver dollar, guys. A guy gave this to me and told me to keep it with me that it gives me good luck. And he said he had one with him for years and it brought him blessings and what's deep is that where we were in the pawn shop and he found the same coin and he was buying one for his daughter and so he handed me that one and um, here's another lip product this is that mac old baby that i showed you guys in the outfit of the day video that i have on that's like my favorite matte lip product um the next thing i have is this coach um card holder well it's not a card holder it's like a little zippy card holder oh my gosh guys i'm so sorry about charles but and it has my keys on there i have to get a new one because it's tearing up and it just barely made a year hold on guys this is too much noise okay guys so i'm back okay so here is my um coach card holder in black denim and um, this is super popular it has a zip top up here and then i have some cards on both sides you could comfortably put like four cards on each side and like double up in each slot um oh wait that has one two three so it has three slots so that's really good so that's like six cards anyhow 
I got that from Macy's. Um, and then I have this Gingham Gorgeous hand cream that I got. It's the purse size or travel size from Bath & Body. I have the hand sanitizer by Bath & Body right there. And then I have my spray deodorant that is crucial, especially during the summer months when we have on our tank tops and dresses and catching all that direct sun. I have my alcohol pads. Always keep those with me. You never know when you need to wipe off a surface or you touch something. And then I also have in here this black denim wristlet and I just keep on the actual leather strap I keep a hair clip and and then on the inside of here I showed you guys I have like a nail file or they also call that an emery board I have a card a credit card in there and this if you can see in there you can see the slots the card slots and then I have a key fob to get into my door in my building. I have some more lip products. Um, I have some vinegar cream that I like to use. Um, I have another lip product. And I have some mints, some little peppermints. And I like to keep like Ricola with me. And, um, and I like to keep gum. But anyway, guys, usually that's what's in here is like them. So that's the last thing that's in my purse. Now it's completely empty. Let me take out this little piece. Okay, yeah. Now it's completely empty. Perfectly, you guys can see in there. You can see that plate I was talking about and the zip pocket. The zip pocket is pretty deep. So you can get a lot in there. I really like this purse. Let me show you guys the back of it. And then let me show you guys the bottom, the bottom of it. There's no feet, but this does have the shape of the Alma, the Louis Vuitton Alma bag. And um, pretty much it has the structure. So I do feel like this was inspired or their version of an Alma because it is like that half moon shape. The, um, these straps are detachable. So you could definitely take them off. They're removable. And um, I don't know, cause you could put this inside of a larger bag if you didn't want to use it as your main handbag. You could put this inside of a larger bag. You could use this as a toiletry um, or a catch all inside of a larger handbag. It's totally up to you. So I hope you enjoyed this video. My Charles is acting up and I'll see you guys in the next one. Hugs and kisses, guys. Happy Wednesday. Those are the sides of the handbag. Okay.